Okay, okay, I'll do some more inaccuracies for you. Too many of you have asked for me to not do this, so here we go. Ah, the Tudors. Like, who doesn't love the Tudors? I love the Tudors despite all the inaccuracies, and let me tell you, there are plenty. I will, of course, not talk about every single one because there are loads and loads and loads of little tiny ones, which, let's just not go there. But let's go for the bigger ones. Starting off strong with the very first scene. If you remember, the Duke of Urbino is assassinated in a church. This is then said to be Henry's uncle. What? This uncle is totally made up and I for one do not know why they made it up. Henry VIII didn't even have an uncle at this point. Following that, there are a bunch of introductions of people who weren't even at court at the time, one of them being Thomas Tallis. But let's just skip all of that and go for this big one that really irks me. Oh, Catherine. This is my favorite representation of Catherine of Aragon. I do not care that she doesn't look like her. I do not care that she's too old. She is, but that's an inaccuracy I'm happy to forgive because she's just chef's kiss. The inaccuracy I want to talk about, however, is when she and Henry are discussing her failure to produce a son. And of course they mention little baby Henry, the Duke of Cornwall. And he is the subject of my upcoming book, which is coming out tomorrow. Ah! But the inaccuracy is that in the TV show, she quite clearly says that he lived four weeks. In reality, baby Henry lived for only 52 days, and that is seven and a half weeks. I can already hear some of you in the comment section saying, what does it matter? It's such a small thing. But let me tell you why it matters. As the title of my own book says, The Forgotten Prince. Nobody considers this child, but he was so important. Just let's get it right. What would have been the difference to the screenplay and the production of the show for them to have simply said, he lived for 52 days, instead of he lived for four weeks? What's the difference? None. But the difference to us is great because we need to know the facts. Henry, Duke of Cornwall, lived for 52 days. That is the fact. And them saying four weeks, it baffles me. As a mother who experienced a lot of loss, Catherine of Aragon would have been specific. She would have been absolutely precise about just how long her baby survived, her male heir. I'm absolutely sure it was engraved into her very soul. And for the production to dismiss this vital fact as unimportant to even get right, it is disrespectful to everything that Catherine of Aragon went through before and after the divorce. So if you want to learn more about baby Henry, you need to read my book, The Forgotten Prince. It comes out tomorrow on Friday the 5th of April, and I am so excited for you to read it and tell me what you think.